So my name's Jimmy Cross. I'm the Head of Research and Specialist Computing at the University of East Anglia, where I've been working for the past 30 years. So I lead a team of six developers who are responsible for delivering research computing services to the UEA research community. These services include high-performance computing, a managed Linux desktop estate, and bespoke support for research projects. 91% of the research at UEA is classed as world leading. The HPC cluster at UEA is named Ada, after Ada Lovelace, the first computer programmer. Back in 2020, the School of Computing Sciences submitted a funding bid to support a range of interdisciplinary research initiatives between the School of Computing Sciences, other schools at UEA, and our partners over at the Norwich Research Park. The aim of the bid was to improve the GPU provision, mainly for AI and machine learning type research. So the solution had to integrate into the existing HPC infrastructure, which is built on Fujitsu and Intel architecture. Hello, I'm Jake Newman and I'm a lecturer in the School of Computing Sciences at UEA and I was previously a research software engineer in the Research and Specialist Computing team. Fujitsu delivered a 15-node GPU farm and integrated it into our HPC. It had 30 NVIDIA RTX 6000 GPUs and each one had an Intel Xeon Platinum processor. The GPU farm helps us meet an increasing need for neural network and AI workflows. Networks that would take days to train on a conventional CPU can train in a matter of hours on the GPU farm, helping our researchers do their work more efficiently. The GPU farm has increased our AI and machine learning capabilities, which has led to some funding for exciting, wide-ranging and impactful projects. So in one project, which is a collaboration with the School of Psychology, we've been looking at how mothers and babies interact when they play with toys. So we've been using machine learning and artificial intelligence to track toys in videos of mother-baby interactions, and we're getting some really exciting insights into how children learn. In another project involving the School of Computer Science and the Norfolk and Norwich University Hospital, a novel medical device has been developed which is meant to detect periods of dizziness or vertigo. And we've used artificial intelligence and neural networks to do exactly that. Due to the existing relationship with Fujitsu, they were quickly able to understand their requirements, turning it into a viable and cost-effective solution within budget and timescales. 